Yo gamer sup, I have a question, what was the right game at the wrong time for you? For me it was Warframe and it was way back around 2019. I started playing the game again recently and I'm having a blast, kinda regretting not to play this early on but hey, I don't think it's too late to join the party right? The game always has an appeal to me, it's because Playing a space ninja and destroying everything? Who doesn't like that? So what makes me not to get into the game in the first place? It wasn't about the overwhelming content of this game, and I don't mind getting into complicated parts of any game that I find interesting. I can say in a cheeky way that I was under the curse of From Software games, uh, such as Dark Souls and Bloodborne back then, and also it was in the middle of Monster Hunter World Hype that I was there and sinking all of my time and attention, I was, I was really having a hard time to get into new games because of that reason. Uh, it was bad for finding new games, though it was also good because uh, that made me save more money because I didn't spend spend much money to buy random games for years but these days i can appreciate more genres again after not engaging with those types of game but actually i played bloodborne and sekiro months ago but i just finished both again and i didn't stay long i, I just finished it that's it anyway what can i say about warframe anyway there are lots of things to say here. I'll just make it shorter because I don't want to waste your time. So here are my short thoughts. Combat. Combat is easy. It's easy to understand in the most part at least. The combat feels fluid and addicting. The melee range is so satisfying which is good to retain my attention for playing consistently of course. Oh, and it's floaty, but I mean it in a good way because it works for this game. Arcwing. Oh, bro, Arcwing. Arcwing is 10 over 10. Arcwing is the best. I wasn't expecting this gameplay. Like, this is crazy. I really like uh, the Arcwing. Like, I'm losing words. As as you can see, I'm, I'm losing words. It's just, it's a 10 over 10. Yeah. A 10 over 10. And they just make a game that revolves around the Arcwing gameplay? I wonder if Arcwing is still relevant in the end game. Huh. Well, I'll be sad if... if not. Is there a fun cop in this game also? I wonder what that is. I tried cop once with my homie, so I can't say much about it for now. Also, yes, this one, the cinematic camera. Bro, I wasn't expecting this. I always love to play around with the camera mode in in any game. If there is a camera mode or photo mode, whatever that is. And this was quite surprising to me. So in short, I'm loving this camera mode here. It's 10 over 10. So that's also one reason that I'm kind of regretting not to play this early on. But hey, it's just okay, right? Anyway, I'm not looking forward to the time when this game is gonna start slapping me that this is a free-to-play game. Whatever are those reasons, mm, hopefully it wasn't that bad, but mm, let's see. Anyway, that's it for now. I'm still in the early game and I know there's a long path ahead for me to the end game and I'll just enjoy it. Hopefully, hopefully I'm still enjoying this game because I'm starting to love this game. I can see it. And and hopefully, yeah, I'm still enjoying this game for for the upcoming days or maybe months. Who knows? Let's see. Oh, and also I live stream this game here in this channel. So if you want to hang around and maybe a little help for for this game because sometimes things are quite confusing so uh, that will be really appreciated 
Anyway, that's it. See you next time.